Welcome back, Fantasy Moto fans, to a very special episode of Roto X Fantasy. My name is Donnie, and with the MXGP series starting up in just a few days, today I'm going to teach you how to play MX Vice's MX Manager, the only way to play MXGP Fantasy. But first, why would you want to play Fantasy Moto at all? Well, there are a few simple reasons. Obviously, it's fun, it makes the race weekends more interesting, it's an easy way to show how well you know your moto, and of course, the prizes. But we'll get into those in just a little little bit. First things first, the opening round of MXGP takes place on March 1st, so you have just a few days to create your account and consider your picks. Every week you're going to be assembling a team using a budget of 1.2 million pounds. You can select up to 5 MXGP riders, up to 5 MX2 riders, and optionally you may also take an MX bike manufacturer such as Honda and an MX team such as Red Bull KTM. Let's take a look at a few examples of how you might set up your team. First, you could spend your entire 1.2 million budget on just two riders. Taking the two favorites for the MXGP series would take up all of your points. Or you could go all in, risk everything, take 10 small riders that might score zero points or that might score huge, and a small team and small manufacturer, and maybe you'll hit it big and you'll also probably end up with a lot of zeros. Or what most people are gonna do, you're gonna take three to six podium contender type riders and maybe one of the more prestigious teams in the paddock and build your team that way. So how should you build your team? Well, for that, you're going to know to know how the game scores. The riders you pick will score the same points on the track as they will for you. So if Jeffrey Erlings goes out and goes 1-1, he's going to take home a cool 50 points. If he runs third in one moto, but in the second moto he gets tangled up in a crash and manages to only finish 17th, he would score 29. It's pretty simple. The team and manufacturers, however, score a little differently. Since each pick likely has multiple riders, the team and manufacturers only score for the overall, not poor moto, and have a much less points than individual riders. So if you were to take Team HRC and the defending champion gets second overall and Evans gets seventh, you would score 13 points for HRC. The same scoring would go if you choose a manufacturer. If you choose KTM, every rider in both classes on an orange bike that score top 10 are going to net you some points. There are also a few additional bonus point scenarios to go over as well. The rider that has the absolute fastest lap over the course of both of their motos in their class would be awarded five points. So one GP and one MX2 rider will each get five points. And then five points will go to the rider that scores the whole shot in each moto. And yes, if your rider scores both motos, then they're gonna double up with 10 points. All right, so let's get to those prizes. What can we win? Well, in the base game, nothing. It's free to play and just for fun. But if you want to sign up for the premier version of the game, which is just a modest 12 pounds or 12 US dollars, you are immediately entered in to win some of the raddest prizes you can imagine. Over 20,000 pounds and dollars worth of prizes are going to be on the line. And a lot of different sponsors are getting involved. Score the most points out of the entire game, and you're going to be taking home two VIP Motocross of Nations tickets courtesy of Monster Energy themselves. One lucky player chosen at random is going to win a brand new KTM 125SX, but that's not all. Another player, totally random, you can be the worst fantasy player of all time, doesn't matter. One lucky player will get an all expenses paid trip from anywhere in the world to Florida. And what's in Florida? Stew. You will be accompanied by Lewis and James of MX Vice to go to the Stu compound and personally meet and hang out with James Stewart. How rad would that be? Unfortunately, we will not be doing weekly previews for MX Manager here on Roto. Honestly, I'm just not well-versed enough in MXGP to be able to properly help you with those picks. But I will be joining the Paid League in hopes to analyze the game and provide some insight for you guys in the future. So are you ready to sign up? Head over to mxvice.com slash mx dash manager or just simply click the link in the description below to get signed up for totally free and then pull out that wallet and trade those 12 pounds or dollars for a premier pass and the chance for all of those fabulous prizes. Stu, did I say Stu? As always, be sure to follow us on Twitter and Instagram for fantasy, moto, content, and news and subscribe to the YouTube channel if you are new. I'm Donnie, this is Roto X. Good luck, thanks for watching. Take care.